YouTube was good with it, was good with it, was good with it. I'm super excited about today. Finally getting this series kicked off. We about to tap into some local brands. I ain't gonna even make you wait for it today. Let's get into it. Let's rock and roll. What's good? What's cracking? What's happening? It's your boy Moves the Alpha, and I'm excited to be here today, yo. I'm excited to be alive. Yo, I'm excited to start this series today. So, yes, I told you guys that we would be doing this. I'm partnered up right now with GrowYourClothingBrand.com, and we are now going to be tapping into some of the local brands. I'm going to be bringing them to you live here on the channel. I'm going to be buying your clothes with my own money. These are not being sent to me. These aren't promos or people are writing me in a DM saying like, hey, yo, I'm going to send you something if you review it really good for me. No, I'm buying it with my own money. Like I told y'all, I'm trying to tap into some of the local brands from around America, really around the world, because I even got some that I'm looking at that's from like Australia, the Netherlands, all type of stuff. But yes, no, that's not why we're here today. Today, we are here to officially review the very first clothing brand, the local brand. And, and I'm excited to show y'all this. So today we are taking a look at, and sorry if I say this wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm saying this right, Gianti. So we're about to take a look at some of the pieces that I picked up last week from Gianti. They just came in a couple of days ago, and I'm about to just tell y'all about my experience. I'm just gonna take it, tell you about the packaging, yo, the clothing, how's the material, what's the quality looking like. Yo, we about to tap into all of that today. So yeah, without further ado, let's tap into it, let's go. All right, so boom, before we actually get to unwrapping some of the packages and taking a look at the pieces that I picked up, I wanted to tell you about Grow Your Clothing Brand and how this is even coming into fruition. So Grow Your Clothing Brand is a dot com that's essentially allowing you to promo your brands, all the locals, for the free ski, yes. And I always tell you that for the free ski, free 99. Ain't nothing in this world free, but they doing it for y'all for the free ski. They're allowing local brands to promote themselves for free. So if you got good pictures, you got good pieces, you know, you really trying to get a name out there, yo, tap in to growyourclothingbrand.com. They're helping a lot of people out. And if you just have a thought or an idea that you're waiting to try to put on some mock-ups and start selling to the world, they're giving you all the tips and tricks you need so that way you don't gotta fail like some of your other peers and you can get your clothing brand rocking and rolling earlier. But without that, listen, I don't know what y'all gonna be doing, man. Y'all gonna be stuck out here failing and trying to get it right. But tap in to grow your clothing brand. They're gonna make sure that you're getting right. They're gonna make sure you're starting up, doing good, and promoting it after you have a perfect product. But now, let's tap into the product that I picked up. Let's go. All right, so starting out first, I'm just gonna work top to bottom exactly how they came out of the package. So starting off, I wanna say that, yo, their packaging is some of the hardest packaging that I've saw. I'm gonna throw a picture up over here of like what it looked like when it came um, in there. I'm pretty sure if you are like a 90s baby, you had like the, like the three or four set game on your uh, computer when you can go in there, like the one where you would hit the little tiles and it would just blow up everything. We would just be clicking out on what we're doing. Yes, man. They really went OD when they did the packaging. So I got to give them a 10 out of 10 on packaging. That was really good. But like I said, I'll put that picture up there for y'all to see it. And then opening up the package, this is the first thing that I saw on the top. This is like a box. And I'm not cheating y'all. I promise I didn't open these before. I literally waited to do this on camera. This says the quiet before the storm. And I think that's kind of go on, kind of go into the, some of the pieces that we saw. This is Gianchi. And let's see what we got inside of here. Let me see. I'm going to let y'all see it first. What's inside of it? I don't know. Oh yeah, this is pretty cool. This, oh, that's hard. They got the head and the clouds. You can see it inside of the box there. And it just look like some stickers, really good on the merch. I'll definitely be keeping these. I love to keep stuff like this for like collectors and memorabilia. I'll put it into like with all my other collectibles and stuff that I have for some of the other brands that I uh, own. So that's really cool. Um, cool point for this, and I did not pay for this. This just came inside of the packaging. Um, so yeah, shout out to Deontay for doing that for me. All right, so moving into next, I picked up a pair of shorts. But uh, for them, this is a size medium because I feel like I'm getting into the days now where I'm in the gym, you know what I'm saying? I got to go for the medium, but I used to be doing smalls. But all right, so our first thoughts, these feel really good. Like the quality feel good. It doesn't feel cheap. Um, this is like a this is like a thicker material. I really like this. And then, yeah, this is like spring print on there. So you don't got to worry about this like fading or peeling off. But nah, these is hard for, I really like this. I'm, you know, I've been, I've been getting ready for the summer for a couple months here. I'm stocking up on the shorts. But yes, this is like the uh, the GameCube. I was about to say the GameCube G. I like how they played off on that. So let me see if I can show y'all the Bianchi on the uh, GameCube G there. I mean, if y'all played the GameCube back in the day, like the Dreamcast, GameCube, the Sega, 
type and yo even on the tag yo they went crazy i love the detail like on the tag it looks like how you used to be able to do it like in old video games where you have like the attributes they put on there so yeah no i'll definitely give that i'll give that like an a plus when it comes to like you know the attention to detail it's looking at creativity quality consistency availability hey and they got like a, it's like a quality control sticker so yeah i'm definitely giving them some points for that and on the back here we have what does it say the quiet before the storm so it definitely seems like that was either a theme i don't know if that's like their you know their tag that they're always going to run with or if this is just for the season but nah man i gotta say that these shorts are super duper hard i can't wait to put these on this summer y'all know white red and black is like my go-to if i throw a little gray in there but that's my um go-to and these are actually reasonably priced um i think for like 35 bucks is what i got these shorts from and after feeling the quality is definitely worth 35 bucks the string feels really good they have like nice aglets on the top there if the camera can kick, uh, catch that and pick that up aglets look really good on the shorts but yeah, man, there's not much to it. It's really like a simple short. You can put these on in the summertime. They have other colorways in this, but I just went with everything white because I knew the summer was coming. Gotta be so fresh and so clean, clean. But yes, no, that's why I did the white. But yes, no, I like the shorts a lot. This is fire. Like I said, you don't have to worry about the um, Gianchi fade on there because that is screen printed in. That's not like an iron on type of deal. So gotta give them another cool point for that. So these are some shorts that are gonna last. As long as you know how to wash and clean, they don't seem like they should be too dingy and it's not like a pair of shorts where you'll wear them like every day. You gotta, you know what I'm saying? If you're gonna go with the white shorts, you gotta be coming with a fit. You ain't wearing these every day. Pulling these out for a special occasion. But yeah, no, I gotta give the shorts. I'm really, I'm really rocking with that. I like these a lot, but let's go ahead and tap into the next piece. We're gonna just keep it, we're gonna keep it rocking and rolling live. I ain't gonna do the cut for it. So yes, yeah, shirt comes in one of these packaging. This is pretty decent, you know. You can definitely tell that he put some time into, you know, how he's packaging up and sending out his stuff. But, oh yeah, oh yeah, quality is all there. Yeah, yeah, I'm rocking with, bro. I'm rocking with what he got going on. Sorry, I didn't drop the silica pack. But yeah, so no. Here we go. So, boom. We got another one, bro. This feels good. Like, hey, yo, bro, who's doing this thing with this? The tag is hard. Look how big this tag is on the inside area. Yo, that is fire. All right, boom. This is like a new, like a news weather uh, channel type of deal. You know, put you on channel seven, you get to acting crazy. But yeah, it's like a, and it's more like a box. Here. It's a little bit wide. Yo, I'm rocking with this. Y'all going crazy. I'm really feeling what he did there. What they say? Unprecedented storm approaching. So yeah, they definitely going with that theme of you know the cry before the storm. I don't know who's the news channel or who news dude this is, but now nah, I'm really feeling this piece. It's hard. Then on the back. You got the cry before the storm and I put you on channel seven news, QDTS. I don't even know what that means, but yeah. What you need to know how to prepare, Gianchi. Hey, yeah, no, they really took their time with doing this weather, sports news and more on the front there. But yo, I'm really feeling this tag, yo, bro. Let me take a look back at this. Like, I ain't never seen a tag like this big. This something that, yeah, that definitely took some work to do that. So I'm really feeling the way that he took the time. That's something different inside there. But yeah, that's just like a nice box. And I believe this after filling this as well. So I believe I paid 30 bucks or 35 for this. No, this is definitely quality. And I know for a fact this came in a black one. I'll probably spend the block now to get the black t-shirt on this because now nah, I'm definitely going to be wearing this this summer. This is fire. I don't think I would put these together. I don't think I would do the white on white on top of this in the summer. I would definitely put like a red bottom on or a black bottom to go with the shirt and then vice versa. I would probably do like a black shirt over at the top. But individually, yo, no, these are some pieces. I got to I gotta give it to them. The quality is definitely top tier. I know sometimes when you have people charging like 35 bucks for t-shirts and stuff like that, you're like, dang, I really hope that it's there. But no, I gotta give it to them, y'all. Like the quiet before the storm, like you can tell the attention to detail and everything. There's not anything that came in here generic. Everything was branded, you know, a fit the theme. Everything is going on crazy. But yes, no, I really, I really gotta give it to them. Claps up. We starting off really good on the channel, getting some pieces in there. But no, I'm really feeling these. I like the shorts a lot. Um, I like the packaging. I like what they did there. But yeah, no, I gotta give this. If I could rank this. I don't know, I don't want to start off perfect because then you got to follow up that, but I definitely get them like an eight and a half, nine out of 10 when it came to attention to detail, pricing, packaging, the experience, you know what I'm saying? I even talked to them a little bit before and told them I was going to do this, but it wasn't even biased. Like, like I said, I spent my own $75 to get these in and I told them I was going to be honest, but yeah, no, honestly, y'all did good. I'm, I'm rocking with it. Now, like I say, I think they even got some sweatsuits on there too that I was looking at for me and my uh, leading lady. I have to spend a block now to grab the sweatsuits, knowing that the quality bit on their pieces. They ain't really take no shortcuts. Like these don't feel thin. Like I'm like I said, I'm gonna hold them up to the camera again. Hopefully they can pick that up. Like these ain't thin shorts. You can definitely rock these. 
you can feel comfortable. So, yeah, man, I'm gonna have to give all the pieces, you know what I'm saying? Like a good eight and a half, nine out of 10. I'm really rocking with, with Gianchi going over there. So I'm gonna go ahead and link their pictures. I'm gonna link their um, they IG and everything over here. So Y'all can go ahead and tap in with them. Hey, yo, go support them. That's what I'm saying. This is what this is for. It's not just for you to watch me unbox stuff and be like, oh yeah, that does look cool. Tap in with them. Go shoot them a follow. Go shoot them a DM. Tell them like, hey, yo, move the alpha send you. Hey, go buy some stuff from them. Support them. That's what we that's what we're here to do this for. I'm not just trying to review it, put it in my closet. Yeah, I'm gonna see me wearing it in the video. Like, go support, go tap in right now. Follow their Instagram. I'm gonna link everything right here. I'm gonna put they um I'm gonna put the information down in the description so y'all can tap in with them. So go right now. Shout out to Gianchi. I believe that their uh, ideas like Gianchi World. Shout out to y'all, but y'all really doing some good quality pieces, and that's why I started with y'all when I was looking through the list. This is a great start, so yeah, shout out to Gianchi. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Everybody calm down, chill, chill, chill. Before we tap up out of here, I gotta say thank you to all my supporters. Thank you to everybody that keeps continuing to hit that subscribe button. Thank you for the people hitting the follow button over on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok. Shout out to all of y'all, yo. Y'all really making this dream of mine come true. We are so close to 2,500 subscribers. I'm pretty sure that we should hit that by the end of next week because I got some videos coming. I got some his and hers on the Yeezy that just got delivered right before I made this. I'm still holding that pair of bronze just because I felt like I wanted to get this out. So I still got a pair of bronze that I'm about to show y'all probably in a couple of days. But yes, I had to stop and tell y'all, yo, y'all been rocking out. Y'all been smashing that subscribe button. We close to 2,500. I don't even remember what we were before today. I want to say it was either 21 or 2,200. One of those, but we getting close to 2,500 and I'm getting super excited, yo, because we've seen this thing grow every single day. So shout out to y'all, man. Y'all the true rock stars. I'm just behind the camera. Y'all the ones really doing all of the work. You get what I'm doing? I'm giving y'all some props. That's what y'all be doing. But yes, no, for real. Before we check up out of here, got to give another shout out today to, to Gianchi for being the very first preacher brand on the Grow Your Clothing brand series. And I'm going to be tapping into the brands that are posted on our website. So big shout out to them. Thank you to them for that. I'm definitely going to be spinning the block to get some more pieces. Like I say, make sure y'all go shoot them a follow. All of their description and uh, all of their information will be down in the description. I get a little tongue tied when I'm up here on camera, but yes. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on all my platforms, all my socials. Moves the Alpha, M O O Z T H E A L P H A. Moves the Alpha on all my platforms. Make sure you tap in, support me, continue to smash that subscribe button. And I'm going to see y'all real soon because, like I say, I got the heat. And I don't even got no shoes to push into the camera. So I'm just going to say, we out of here.